Hello everyone, my name is Dila Prila Jayuna. My student's number is 192122047. All right, in this section, I would like to continue the presentation by Citra about multimodal analysis tools on social media. The next is the media dimension. In social semiotics, media refers to the material resources used to realize meaning in social practice according to Crest 2010, and is seen as the material substance of semiotic resources. We can distinguish between production media and distribution media. Production media is seen as resources in the production of messages, according to Crest and Van Nguyen in 2001, and includes both the tools and the materials used. And then the distribution media refers to resources for the dissemination of meanings as message, according to CRAS 2003. To sum up, social media software analysis with special emphasis on how software reconfigures resources is therefore an important part of the media dimension in the proposed framework. The next is the material dimension. Materiality matters. It matters to how and what kind of meanings are made also in social media settings. One aspect of the materiality of social media concerns the physical materiality of the device. And then codes and algorithms are material manifestations of software. To sum up, the material dimension concerns how materialities are represented in various social media. All right, the next is the historical dimension. A historical perspective of semiotic resources is integral to social semiotics. One aspect of this dimension concerns the historical development of a given social medium, uh, previous versions, uh, update history, added features, withdrawal of features, and so on. The historical interest also concerns uh, the role of social media in transformations in existing social practices and the emergence of new practices. Therefore, the historical dimensions include uh, the discourses that surrounded uh, social media, the ways a social media medium is introduced, marketed, discussed, and criticized, as well as the ways user adopt, adapt, or reject them. And the last is the critic dimension. Social semiotics and multimodality studies are closely related to critical discourse analysis, or CDA, and critical theory in general, according to Fair Club 2003. And um, one of the versions of CDA is discourse historical approach or DHA, which concerns three interrelated aspects. The first one is text or discourse immanent critique that seeks to map inconsistencies, self-contradictions, paradoxes, and dilemmas. The second is socio-diagnostic critique that aims to uncover the persuasive or manipulative strategies in discursive practice. And uh, the third is perspective critique that seeks to improve people's communication skills and empower social actors with better resources for participation according to WADAC 2015. All right, that's uh, all uh, the material uh, from me. Thank you very much. I apologize for all the mistakes and the next material will be delivered by my friend.